So I actually had a different idea for today's video and I wanted to do a little bit more advanced tutorial but it ended up not working. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you a different version which is the simpler version and in the future I will try to make a little bit of a more advanced tutorial on these like sort of like portal effect. So yeah let's jump right into the video okay so ideally ideally you want to have two clips that are sort of like the same speed and that are going in the same direction sort of like the two clips that i have here both of them are going forward and both of them are going at a relatively similar speed and then we're gonna go so we're gonna go here to a copy of this clip and we're gonna find the portion of the clip that we want to use. I like to use these two trees. Uh, it looks really cool because as the drone goes between them, it looks like a cool place to add our portal. So we're gonna cut this first clip right here, and then we're gonna go one second and maybe two if you want. You can. It, it, it's all depending. It all depends on what you want to do. If you want your portal to be seen a little bit longer, you can make it longer. Okay, then we're gonna go to the color tab and inside the color tab, we're, what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a new serial by creating here. Right click, add node, add serial. And then we're gonna create an alpha output. And we're gonna create our circle mask here and we're gonna adjust this size. This way you can play around with it. Uh, you can do all this stuff and up to your liking and then here in the tracking window we're not gonna track yet what we're gonna do is we're gonna change from cloud tracker to point tracker and we're gonna add a point here and whoops not that we're gonna add a point here and we're gonna move this point right onto our tree and we're gonna add a second point and move that to the other tree that way when we track it's sort of gonna try to use those two trees as the reference for our tracking and if we press play here we can see that the tracking and our portal sort of stays there. Right now we're not seeing the effect of the portal because we have not connected our alpha output yet. If we do, we're gonna see these, but we have to go here to the king point and we're gonna invert this. Uh, and it being just black like that is not that cool. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna keyframe a couple of things. So we're gonna go here and create a keyframe for a circle window and we're gonna create keyframe the size to zero first of all and then we're gonna go like five or six frames and we're gonna make it 50 and then we're also gonna animate the opacity uh, so we're gonna go here and we're gonna make this zero and then all the way here it's gonna be a hundred so that's gonna sort of like show up a little bit like that and we're gonna also play around with the softness of it a little bit. Okay, so now we have our portal ready. You can play around with it as much as you want, but we are pretty much set on this basic portal. We're going back to the edit window. If we put our footage behind this, we can align it any way you want, and we can get rid of the extra part right here. You can already see that we have the portal uh, showing up and we can see the, the thing that we have below already. And the reason why this is working well together is because the clip below is actually moving too. So then it sort of like sells the effect better. One thing here that we saw is that there's a weird rough cut of our portal, right? So what we want to do is we're gonna add a, like a little bit of a fade out with this marker right here. And that is going to help us to sort of like make it a little bit less, um, less, what do you call, less, we'll make it a little bit more smooth to the eye. It's not going to be just straight up cut on the, of that clip. And that is pretty much how you would add that portal. We can also, you can also then go ahead and add motion blurs or whatever you want. Uh, using the effects library and stuff like that, but I'm not gonna do that. But yeah, that is a basic portal and just by playing it like that, you can... Well, that is pretty much it for this video. I hope that you enjoy it and I hope to see you in the next episode here in Suave. In the meantime, I got some more exploring to do.